Women's participation in the labor force in Pakistan is among the lowest in the region. Less than 25% of women in Punjab's urban areas work. But more than 25% of women who are not working show a desire to work. So why don't women work? What are the barriers for them in joining the labor force? And how important are these barriers? What policies will help address these barriers? The Women's Mobility Project at SERP aims to answer those questions through studying two factors, the availability of transport and the ability to search for and apply to jobs. So the availability of safe transport, we understand is a barrier to women. Uh, women are more dependent on public transport. Uh, they're less likely to have their own transport to commute to work. And more importantly, they're more prone to risks of harassment and social stigma when traveling with unrelated men. Now this can affect women in ways such as whether or not they should take a job, so in making that decision. And even when they do make that decision, then the kinds of job that they should be taking or where this job should be located. For our research, we've also come up with a job facilitation platform by the name of Job Talash. Um, the purpose of this platform is to help us study whether women have the resources and the skills that are needed to search for jobs and apply for them. Um, under our Job Talash platform, there are three particular services we offer our job seekers. Uh, we help them make CVs. We help them uh, match to jobs that uh, employers list down with us and we also help them uh, apply for those jobs on, on their behalf. Um, the job Talash services are completely free and they're open to both male and female subscribers. Um, we're also offering uh, certain other additional services to some of our uh, beneficiaries. Uh, we give them training and counseling services. For instance, um, we give them training on how to interview. Some of our job seekers are also given transport related services by us. Um, so for instance, if they have to go from office to home and from home to office, we provide this service to them, door to door. The reason we do that is because it helps us understand how transport affects their decision to work and also the sorts of jobs that they take up. Currently, the Job the Lash platform has 10,000 job seekers registered with it and also 800 employers. Our research tells us that transport is in fact incredibly important in motivating women who are not working to join the labor force. We found out that 90% of non-working women who are willing to work would like to if transport was provided. Unfortunately, we find that very few employers currently offer transport to their employees. Does that mean that employers are not willing to hire women for jobs? According to our research, this is not true. Employers are actually very willing to hire females for positions at their organizations. This is true even for employees who currently have no women working at their organizations. The Women's Mobility Project aims to bridge this gap between job seekers looking for jobs and employers willing to hire women for jobs.